Hey guys, your realtor Laura McDonald here with a quick Tuesday tip for you. So there's not a lot of consensus or agreement about what is to come with this market. Some uh, companies are predicting that the uh, prices will continue to rise at about 13%. Some people are predicting closer to 7%. Uh, Redfin is predicting closer to 3%. Uh, but the mortgage bankers of America are actually predicting a drop of two and a half percent. So we're all across the board as far as what are prices going to continue to do in this next year. What do we know? What we do know is that there's a large group of millennials getting ready to turn 30 over this next year. Uh, that is prime home buying age. So I do believe that these millennials will continue to fuel this market with a lot of buyers, which is going to create that sense of urgency because we are gonna continue to see that lack of inventory for as many buyers as we have in this current market. Above and beyond that though, we are predicting interest rates are actually going to go up probably by almost a full percent. And what does that mean to you? Well, 1% interest rate is a $10,000 difference in what price you can purchase or what you afford. So even if prices do go down, say in this next year, I don't think they're gonna go down by 10%. If they do go down by that 2.5% predicted price, that 1% interest rate increase is still going to have you paying more for that house next year than you would today. So if you are thinking about waiting, maybe next year, sometime later in the year to buy because you think things might cool down, I don't believe that's gonna happen, at least not for another year or so. So give me a call, shoot me a message if you have any further questions about the market and any thoughts or input you might have. I'm always open to hear what other people think as well. Hope you guys are doing great. Have a wonderful day.